Guys, this is the ultimate 12S Creighton right here. Yeah, mark that 8 out. It gets a 12 because it's got the new Max 5G2 system with the 800 kV motor. This thing is loaded with Vitavon. I'm going to show it to you on the table, and we're taking it out for a drive. Let's go. Are you ready for this, guys? Holy moly. Woo! Look at that. Oh, my God. I got to show you guys some of the details. Beast 1000 servo. The shocks were recoded by RC Mad Labs to match them up. Yeah, the Max 5G2 right there. Look at that. Beautiful. Sitting right in there nice and tight. The uh, gears. Mod 1.5 by Vitavon. That is a 25 tooth spur gear with a 20 tooth pinion gear. The ESE, good to 12S. Motor, 800 kV, also good to 12S. There's a 650 version, 12S, and an 1100 kV version. That's only good to 8S, but I wanted the 800. The system is nice. The Vitavon bell crank steering is in. Check that out. It does come with a plate so you can mount your ESC up front, but I really wanted mine in the back. Check out these beadlock wheels by Vitavon and the center caps. These things are beautiful and they're built to take the Pro-Line Badlands. These are the only tire to use, let me tell you. It has full Vitavon internals, ring and pinion, spider gears. Obviously the whole bulkhead that outdrives everything is Vitavon. Same with the front. The chassis, Vitavon 7075. I'm using two different sets of batteries for these. The 10,000s on the left are 4S, the 6,000s are 6S. Why? Because I wanna see what it can do on 8S and 12S. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and get this thing started, but I just gotta admire this thing, at least a little bit for right now. <laughs> the four S's are in it. So we're gonna go ahead and get that speed run real quick. Uh, let's see. Nice. It is mild, it is still setting on punch of five. So it's definitely rolling into the throttle. Okay, let's we'll see what it's got. All right. It looks nice and mild on 8S. Looks good, looks good. All right, 43, that's on 8S. Not bad. Now, my biggest hope here is that uh, I've got everything tight. <laughs> That's kind of a big deal, right? Okay, I'm going to cut to the chase. Let's get the 12S in here. Are you ready? <laughs> There's my 12S. Oh, man. It has its own tones, doesn't it? Okay, um, yep, put the body on and let's see what it's got. Ha, <sighs> let's do this. Now the 43.1 is left on there from the 8S. Of course we're gonna get, fi get faster than that, right? Let's uh, see that mild punch at five real quick. Ready? Oh, oh. Oh, all right. Now the thing about the punch is sometimes they can save you parts or sometimes they can cost you parts depending on how the punch is set up and what you're doing with it, but okay. I do not want to roll this thing, not on its first run. <laughs> oh, and I don't want to hit that either. Oh, 
Oh boy. Careful, big boy. All right, we got only 54, 53.9. Now I have got 70 out of this, but it was a different setup. And 55, 54. You know, I bet I can do a one-to-one -one on this because my 25, my 20, 25 gearing is possibly a little bit on the uh, conservative side. <laughs> now, people come out here and they do donuts in their real vehicles. So, it's like you can look at this right here. That's not from me, so. And the way the grass grows here in Florida, uh, yeah. Not gonna be an issue. I may have to try a one-to-one -one on this thing. That thing is beautiful, isn't it? I'm, I'm afraid to get down close to it. No! Oh! 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 My heart almost sank. I almost crashed it. I don't know how. <laughs> okay, we're at 55 now. <laughs> oh, 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 oh man. Okay, I got I gotta calm down. I do not want to crash this thing. At least not yet. I turned the punch up on this thing. I have to do that later. But I bet you this thing will stand right up because it is coming in kind of soft. It is coming in soft. Also, it's been raining and the grass has even less traction than usual. So only 55 right now. And I'm fine with that. I'm not gonna beat it up too bad on the first run, but I do wanna jump it at least a little bit. 12S is still on it. Nice, nice. Beautiful. I gotta be careful, there is some wet clay over there and I am not getting into the wet clay. <laughs> nice. Slow down, big boy, slow down. One more jump, I think. One more jump. Simple, easy, and I think I'm gonna call it. Yeah, nice, easy. Okay, there's something else I wanna hit, gently. Nice. That was nice. Oh! Well, there goes my um, not crashing it thing. Well, I guess it's crashed. I guess we've got the crash in, right? <laughs> and there's another one. Okay, last pass. That was nice and easy right there. I want to land this. Almost. For real, this is the last one. See, I'm landing down the backside of that beautifully. There we go. Ha! Ah! All right, that's it. I'm done. Time to clean off the tires. Yeah, there is zero traction out here. <laughs> None. Wow. 
Well, that was my first drive with the big Creighton 12S. Now, punch setting on five. With the gearing set up at 25-30, it's a 1.25 to one ratio. So yeah, that's also a little bit mild. So overall, it needs to be a 25 to 25 or a one to one ratio. And I need to turn that punch up. As far as overall heat goes, I did not take my little thermal, thermal infrared heat gun, but I did put my fingers on it. And yeah, it was quite a bit warm. But it wasn't so hot that, you know, I went screaming down the road looking for a pond or something, you know. But overall, the thing is good. I've got to turn the punch up and I got a bit put a bigger pinion gear. One to one, full punch. I got to do it. Guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Check that description for links for all the wonderful stuff on the Creighton, the Max 5G2, all that stuff. So, yeah, um, big things. Guys, thank you all for watching, and I hope you have a great day. If you're still watching, you are top shelf. You are the cream of the crop, the pick of the litter. You are phenomenal. Thank you for watching to the end of the video. It means a lot to me. Now, down below, there are links for the products you see. Also, for channel memberships, if you guys want to be a part. Channel members get early viewing on pretty much everything that I can. So, guys, check that description. There's a lot of info down there. Thank you all for watching.